everybody, it's Mama J. Inspector. Guess what? Chicken butt. This box mm -hmm. came with an emergency dad joke. Okay. Can you guess who the box is from? Someone's dad. Someone's, that is true, someone's dad. Let's see what the emergency dad joke is. Do you know, did you know you can get paid for sleeping? No, I did not. That's a dream job. What? <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> All right, so this came from Gilbert over at Danster TV. He always starts his videos with those wonderful dad jokes. Um, that's kind of how I got the name Joe Mama from um, Audrey, his one <laughs> daughter. <laughs> but anyways, we bought a mystery box from them. Okay. It was a $50 mystery box. And, um. It's a big box? I don't remember if it was guaranteed or how, you know, but we buy most of the time to support. But, really quick, we did get this little snack crate. We're trying to see if we even like these. If so, we may go with the bigger ones. Mm -hmm. But right now we got this one. Um, this was the first one. Ironically, it's Canada. Okay. Okay. So we'll open it up and it tells you right here, but it also told me in my email, Canada, there's a, and there's a list of what came in there. Uh, oh, and everything's all yeah. nicely like oh, tied wow. together in this. Yeah, and I think there's only like five snacks in here. Um, if we like it, we're going to get the other one, the bigger ones. <gasps> I already like it. <laughs> Because in there is some ketchup chips. And I love the ketchup chips. And Those we cannot, were the most disgusting we can't get them here. The chips. And know. then there is also the all dressed chips, which, which we can get here and I have in the kitchen. <laughs> There's a reason why, because these taste good and those do not. Ah. All right, let's see what else we got here. Oh, there's actually more snacks than I thought. Okay, so there's a Mr. Big. Which, have we had this one? We have, uh, right? I don't think so. Named after the biggest candy bar sold in Canada. Filled with crunchy peanuts caramel and coated with delicious chocolate. Okay, so this one we may not have tried. Yeah. Okay, but still cool. What else? Uh, next we got Bear Paws Patty's Doubt. And this is... A soft and chewy biscuit made with real bananas, making them resemble freshly oh. baked <laughs> banana bread straight out of the oven. Hey, uh, this is a sucker, and I'm assuming it's a maple sucker, right? It is a maple lollipop, 100% pure maple syrup. And it looks just like a leaf. Look at that. Yeah, that's cool. Um, we're not trying these right now because we've had the snacks from Canada, and we know we like them. We're actually waiting for... Um, the next box when it comes from somewhere else. So if you got the snack crate plus, you got a crush strawberry cream soda. Well, that's why I said I'm thinking about maybe upping this. We'll that see. would have been delicious. And then one of my favorite ones is the coffee crisp. So really cool snacks. Um, like I said, we're not gonna try them because they are Canada snacks. We've had them before. Um, let's put them back in there so we can open the mystery box. But really cool. I'm sure Spectre will take this sucker. This, I'm taking. Uh, I don't know, what was this? Banana bread. Ooh, this is mine. <laughs> He'll take these chips and I'll take these. You have three giant bags of those chips. I know, so you can have a little one. And don't take a Mr. Big. No, you're not. It will split it. It's funny, because I just finished watching Sex in the City all through all six seasons, and they called the one guy Mr. Big. <laughs> yeah, I haven't watched it, but you know, right now while I'm not working, I'm trying to catch up on some stuff that I've never seen. He uses to watch The Office, Community, Parks and Rec. None of that seems to catch my attention. Sex in the City sure did. It did, but I don't know. All right, so it's a $50 mystery box. What do you think that dad joke was worth that we had? <laughs> um, well, 
if it makes you laugh, it's worth a thousand. It was pretty cool. All right, so we're gonna open this up. Uh, we got box number 26. It's because uh, when I got over there, 13 was already gone. 13 is usually my first go-to number, and then we do, you know, the next numbers. We all have our favorite numbers, everybody does. But I know I have a few people that fight me for that number 13. All right, so let me see. I'm going to check in here. Oops. I'm peeking. I'm going to feel them up. Oh, they're bundled all together. Oh, wait. No, maybe they're not. Oh. Okay, I think this one is like a, a two-pack, maybe? Okay. And then... There's two other ones, but the way they're wrapped, I can't tell like what kind of packaging. So, um, you want to do the singles or you want to do the double? I'll do the double. Okay, so I'm going to pull one of the singles right now. Okay. Oh, wait. <laughs> I just moved it and realized that there is um, four, four pops in here and some kind of card. Should I look at the card? Yeah. Oh, there is a card. Should we open it now? Uh, wait. Probably wait, wait, just in okay. case it has. Price. We're gonna wait only because I just pulled that out. All right, so there's four, so we each can pull two. All right, so I'm gonna start with this one. And then she's felt it up for sticker reason. <laughs> oh, do we have this? Yes. Oh, he's a little damaged too. Let's have a little bit of damage. And this is Bulbasaur. Yep. That's some damage, but we'll figure out something to do with them. Gen 1 leaf starter. Alright, no peeking, okay? I'll stop looking. I'm not looking. I was like, something fell out, but it was just paper. And I got. Oh, that one. Well, that one didn't have that thing, but that one does. Yeah. <laughs> Red Chrome Vegeta. You know why I laugh? Because we've had that pop how many times? And you still don't have it in your collection. Yeah. I just Because he doesn't like it. So he keeps giving it to me to get rid of. And yet it keeps coming back. Funny would be if this is like somehow the same one. I know, but there's no way to tell. But that is kind of funny. All right. Um, I'll take the other single pop. So the one didn't have a yellow, unless it fell off somewhere. Didn't have a yellow sticker. But the other ones, um, did. And I got Dark Magician from Yu-Gi-Oh! And he is... Nineteen dollars. Oh, you're beating me. I got six. Wow. Well, I don't know what he's worth. He's probably worth six. All right. So one last one. Oh, it better be worth a million. Oh, what's that? I thought it was a two pack. I thought it felt really weird. <laughs> oh, it's a it's a bundle. Yeah. Oh, I think we've had these before. I think we gave them away during our 1K. Do you need me to help you? Oh, there's so much tape. Where's your knife? He's struggling with that like he wouldn't forbid it. He's still struggling with that. Okay. Wow. <laughs> All right. I got the He-Man t-shirt bundle oh, that's with the cool. glow-in-the-dark pop that's worth 30 bucks. That's pretty cool. Well, we're going to double check prices. It's an extra large. Unfortunately, it doesn't fit us. 
And you know what's funny about this is we keep getting Masters of the Universe pops and nothing that we keep. Yeah. We have a couple 10 inches, we have um, a couple other pops, and now this. But we're going to check value. Um, well, mainly just on this, I guess it doesn't matter, right? I mean, you're still going to win. Well, while you check the value on this. Oh, that's true. I could do that. Okay. I will open, open the, the card. card. Thank you for your purchase. Get notified. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, wait. This is. Oh, no, it's just photo paper. I thought it was a sticker. But there they are. The sticker here. Okay, so this. Funny, it says we have it in our collection. Yeah. Do we? Mm -hmm. Oh. All right, well, this is actually $22, so it's gone up. Okay. And this was 7 Okay. So I had 29 Oh, you got to... So technically, you still won. Yep. But a fifty-dollar box. Again, amazing box from Danster TV. So if you do not follow Danster TV, I will link them down below. Go check them out because this was a pretty awesome box. Yes. So um, unfortunately, no keepers. But technically, I mean, you do. He does keep Dragon Ball, just not that one. And then this one you already have, and this one you already have, actually. So they would have all been keepers at some point. Yeah. You know. Except for the bundle. Well, as I said, you know, except for the bundle. But, you know, let me tell you, it'll go into a either giveaway, Patreon giveaway, something like that. We'll make great use of it. Anyways, guys, thank you for joining us. Again, I will link Daystar TV down below. Remember, give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment. I love reading your guys' comments. And we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time there to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful you and me we meant to be